Good afternoon, everyone. My name is Larry Rosenthal, president and founder of Rosenthal Wealth Management Group. And today we're bringing you one of our monthly learning minutes. The reason why is we've just had a major announcement from the Federal Reserve. The Federal Reserve today decided to cut interest rates by a quarter point. As many of you may know, the Federal Reserve has two mandates. One is price stability or the fight against inflation. And two is maximum employment, making sure the economy is fully employed and engaged in, in production. Let's take a look at the first mandate here, price stability. The Fed decision today to lower interest rates to between 45 to 5%, basically the mid-range rate is now at 4.625 on the Fed funds rate. That was a unanimous decision today by all of the Fed officials. There was not a dissension, which is very good for the economy and that they're all pulling in the same direction right now. The Fed has gained confidence in lowering this rate because they continue to see the progress toward their targeted 2% inflation rate long term. They made a statement today that the economy is still expanding at a very nice pace. The other side of the Fed mandate is employment, maximum employment, because we want to keep people fully employed. There's now more focus on the employment side of their mandate than there is on the inflation fighting side. The risk here is that we do not want to see unemployment start to spike. That's one of the reasons why the Fed is starting to lower interest rates now, because the labor market has been sort of easing at a nice measured pace, uh, which, is, which is all good as long as we can continue to see the unemployment rates remain stable. In this, in this environment. Let's focus for a quick moment on interest rates now. We've seen interest rates the last few weeks start to spike up, and now we've seen the rates after this afternoon start to come down a little bit. Our, our objective, our, our, our observation here is that we're going to continue to see interest rates staying in this tight trading range probably for the next four or five months until we get more action from the Federal Reserve. Well, thank you for your time today and watching our market commentary update from Rosenthal Wealth Management Group. I hope you all have a great weekend.